Happy Saturday, everybody. I hope you're having a good weekend, and I hope you had a good week. And I, well, actually, I hope you had a good two weeks, because I haven't shot a mere minutes in a, in a couple of weeks. I don't know why I didn't shoot one last week. I guess I, I don't know, I must, I must not have had anything interesting to say, I guess. Uh, but anyways, yeah, it's been two weeks. Done the two palette projects, the rustic projects. I hope you've enjoyed those from the response I've been getting. Most of the people have really enjoyed those, and I enjoy working on those a lot because, especially coming off, coming after that hat rack project, <laughs> I hated that thing. That was the biggest pain in the butt project to make, and it just got me thinking. You know, this channel is woodworking for mere mortals. Nobody in their right mind is going to make that hat rack, <laughs> and so. It was fun to make a project that uh, anybody can make. And I've had a lot of people asking me to make projects uh, w using limited tools because a lot of people who watch the show don't have a whole workshop filled with table saws and miter saws and everything. And, uh, and so I think it, it was fun to kind of get to the basics of woodworking and make a couple of cool projects. But it's funny because the one thing that I have learned about making woodworking videos is that it's just impossible to please everyone. <laughs> because I heard from I heard from some people who they don't like the limited tools projects and they're I guess they're afraid that I'm just never going to use my table saw again because I haven't for the past two weeks. Yeah I've got I got a whole room filled with tools here. I'll I'll be using them all again but you know, I get people really just thrive on routine and they expect everything to be the same all the time. But when you make a lot of projects, one every week, all year long, and the video to go with it, you have to you have to mix it up. That's, that's the only way to do it. But mostly this time of year, people want to build outside projects. And so that's why I'm focusing on kind of some spring related stuff. This week, I am going to be putting together a an herb planter or an herb garden, I guess it's a standing one. And I, I think it's gonna be pretty cool and uh, you could also make it with limited tools, but uh, I'll probably use my miter saw. I was just reviewing what I just shot and I realized, I know people are gonna ask me what's going on back there. That's uh, Adventure Time. If you've never seen Adventure Time, it's just the craziest, craziest cartoon. My, my son watches this and so he has the DVR set. That's why it took over my, my serious radio. And, it's recording it right now, but um, I like it. It's a cool show. It's very, very bizarre. <laughs> oh, here's something. Look at this. This wood. You ever seen this magazine? It's called. Let me see if I can get the glare off of it. Woodworking scroll saw, woodworking. Wait, and crafts. Scroll saw, woodworking, and crafts. But uh, look at here. If you turn to the back page of it, look. There's me and Laney. Uh, it looks like we're in my shop together, but it's, we're just photoshopped in there actually. And look, there's my my whirly gig. So this is all about whirly gig wars. Anyways, re remember last year we did the the competition to make a whirly gig. Well, we're doing it again this year. L Laney's really doing it. I'm just kind of <laughs> I'm just along for the ride. But there's gonna be good prizes, and I think there's gonna be a lot more entries this year because it's kind of becoming a bigger bigger thing. So. Uh, start working on those whirly gigs and you can win cash and prizes. It says here last last year Laney put together a prize package worth more than a thousand dollars. This year I think it's gonna be like a million dollars. I think. Don't quote me on that, but I think it's about a million dollars. Oh, I know what I was gonna tell you is that I, I did shoot another Mere Minutes this week. Is that really a Mere Minutes? Well, it sort of is. I just kind of dump everything on this channel. <laughs> but it's a, it's sort of an outtake thing but it was a little funny thing I just had happening this week when I was shooting my video so I thought I'd put it together but it's a it's an unlisted video you may have seen it if you were on Facebook or Twitter I posted the link there and the reason why it's unlisted is just because there's, there's some language in it but <laughs> I didn't want the I didn't want that just to show up in somebody's feed and then somebody who objects to it's not that bad of language it's like PG, anything you would hear on TV, but if anybody heard it and then I would have to hear from it saying, my kid listened to that and they've never heard those words before. They've heard them. But, <laughs> so I didn't, I didn't want it to show up. So I did it as an unlisted thing. So if you want to watch it, you can click on the link right here. Right here. Wow, this is hard to do this in reverse. Right there. That's the link. <laughs> and you can, you can watch that video if you want, but just be warned, there's a little bit of language in there. But I think it was kind of funny, and I don't usually do bloopers, I usually delete all that stuff, but 
I don't usually like bloopers, to tell you the truth, because I, usually they're just boring. People who forget their lines and, and flub, and to me it's not <laughs> that exciting, but there you go. Oh, I should have, I kind of should, I should shoot these mere minutes more often because it has been two weeks and I totally forgot to mention the, the David Marks video. Uh, if you, I'm sure you saw that. It was an April Fool's thing. It's not really a prank or anything. It was just a funny thing we, we put together. But uh, that was a lot of fun to do that. And we knew, David Marks lives in Santa Rosa. It's just right up north of here, kind of that way. <laughs> but it's like a, a half hour drive or so, but. So we thought it would be fun to put that that little thing together, and we knew that a lot of people would just and would, wouldn't know who he who he is. But I think that's sort of part of <laughs> to me what's kind of funny is everybody goes, "Huh? Who's that?" <laughs> but the people who do know David Marks probably found that very funny. So <laughs> I don't know. I thought it turned out really funny, and I hope maybe we sold some DVDs for him. Real nice guy. <laughs> totally nice guy. I'm going to go up and visit him at his shop sometime, although it's like I'm not worthy kind of thing. I mean, a guy is just a master in every sense of the uh, of the word, really, in woodworking. I think he's probably, you know, like one of the top woodworkers in the country, in the world right now. He's the, the top. There you go. The best. Oh, one other thing I wanted to tell you about Keek, and I know I've mentioned Keek a lot, and if you don't want a Keek, that's fine, you don't have to go over there and look at it, but I've really been having a lot of fun kind of posting the updates of my projects as I'm making them throughout the week, and so what I've started to do is I've started to hashtag my projects so that this past week, it was they're all hashtagged at um, Potting Bench, and so that means if you go to either Twitter or Keek and just do, you know, search for hashtag potting bench, all one word, you'll find all of those. So you could watch the whole project from the beginning to the end. And what I wanted to do was show kind of the whole development of the project from my first little idea all the way through building it or designing it, building it, and then um, making the video and, and getting it all done. So you might find that interesting. A whole bunch of 36 second clips. <laughs> this week though, you can get a head start and start looking for uh, potting, no, not potting bench, it's herb, herb planter, herb planter, <laughs> hashtag herb planter, sorry. <laughs> well, it was herb garden, but I looked and there's a lot of things posted under herb garden, so I did herb planter. <laughs>